I feel like Vitafly gonna recap this and say God he caught a 30 on the dime roll. So all y'all wanna know what happened, I'm gonna tell you what happened. He got smoked. That one was crazy out of the game. Sometimes that's Peter, nobody that knows body. Hit his area with 51. Everything in the Vitafly. We used to rapping like that. First the fat boys break up and every day I wake up, somebody got something to say. Oh, you gotta be kidding. Gluezy left the Goonies and Ryder left with him. Check, 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 check. Salute to every single one of y'all out there. I'm feeling better. I'm feeling better. You know what I'm saying? I woke up. It was a little rough this morning, but, 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 but we getting it on. So, um, salute to every single one of y'all out there. I hope everything's going good with y'all. Um, feeling a little, feeling a little better now. I got to watch the two on two with A-Ward. Geechee Gotti, B. Dot Loso, you know what I'm saying? Mixed all in one, mixed all in one. Um, but now, word is coming out. Word on the street. I heard, I heard, I heard, and I bring this to y'all like this because I know a lot of people, you know, they're not really on Twitter. Some people ain't really on Facebook. You know what I'm saying? A lot of folks don't really use a lot of the social media like that. So they get what they get from watching these blogs. Um, Goonies. It pretty much, it's pretty much over. Uh, New Jersey twerk and drugs went back to NWX, you know what I'm saying? Um, I think that that move for twerk especially will be a good one because like I said in another blog, accountability, they will hold him accountable. They do not play with their brand. He will not be, hopefully, you know what I'm saying, he won't be showing up um, Captain Planet recycling, sliding off the tail, you know what I'm saying, YouTube conversion and all that other shit. So hopefully, you know what I'm saying, that'll make him a better artist, you know what I'm saying, because obviously he's a big, he's a star. A lot of people like him as far as what he does, but how his last couple months have been, uh-uh. Um, drugs goes along with him, and, you know, I watched a couple interviews, um, Salute to 15 Minutes of Fame. Uh, they was talking about it, he was saying the Goonies still remain intact or whatever the case may be. But Gluezy and Ryder are now Dolo solo members. I know some of you people are like, I don't really care, like what, what does this mean? But um, respect to both of them dudes individually, you know what I'm saying? Because Jack Boy Maine, he was the first one out. He jumped out the car first, or was it uh, Ace, I mean? Like, first, so alright, how was the Goonie, Goonie Maine here? It was a bunch of them. Um, but most notably, Jack Boy left a couple weeks ago. Ace Amin left. Cuban left. Now Jer Drugs and Twerk to join NWX and now Ryder and Glue. It's all it. Let's just do the math. Let's just save the math. It's over. Like it's a wrap. You know what I'm saying? They all have pretty much went their ways or whatever. Gluezy released a statement or a tweet. Is it a tweet or a statement? It's a state tweet. It's a state tweet. Let's just go like that. You know what I'm saying? I'm cool with every member of the Goonies. They, my brothers in this ish. But as far as the battle rap group, battle rap group, that shit's dead. We can't be a team if we don't play as one. Salute and respect to all involved but Dolo. Basically saying that we can't play, we cannot be a team if we don't play as one. And I think that it's kind of referring to this move that uh, Drugs and Twerk made. Uh, I don't lie. From what I'm hearing is, from I mean, you could take it for what it's worth. You could put my word in dirt. Some people didn't even really know what was going on. They just found out how they found out. I don't know if there was a meeting at the Goonie Land headquarters. I don't know how this shit works. I don't fucking know. I don't, who knows? I don't know. Why? Who, who? I don't know. But I don't know if everybody knew. But Louise is basically saying that uh, they my brothers. We cool, but we can't. If we can't be a team, you know, we we everybody doesn't play as one. So, Swamp, salutes to Swamp and everything that he does. You know, he's quick to troll on everything. He had first commented earlier. So, are there any more Goonies or not asking for this third round for March 15th? Basically, he will be. He's going to get at work about this decision-making move or whatever he decided to do. He responds to Gluezy saying, SMH, guess it's back to Carolina, huh? Don't worry, we popping now. Swamp Town Glue saying, you know, you can always go back home. But I think he's in North Carolina. Swamp, 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 swamp. You've got twerk coming up. You, you better do your, do your numbers, do your numbers because trust and believe. If you get smoked, we'll be here waiting for you. Um, Ryder said, "Got love for every goonie. Niggas are my brothers for life in real life. But as far as this group, I can't do it no more. 
Got to focus on my music and my brand from this point forward, Maryland forever. So Ryder has chose to bid it it out from the Goonies too. I mean, y'all just jumping off the ship now that the others have, you know what I'm saying? Ryder, I think you like the last one to grab your bag, you know what I'm saying? You should have, you the last, last one. Um, and I think this all comes at a term as when it comes to these groups, whether it be battle rap or even hip hop, you're never going to be bigger than the leader. Like none of the G Unit was ever going to be bigger than 50, or none of Saint Lunatics was ever going to be bigger than Nelly, or none of uh, D12 was ever going to be bigger than Eminem. So if you have a star, none of Rockefeller was ever going to be bigger than Jay Z. But if you have, if you have a star, or whoever's supposed to be the leader of the crew, and he does a lot of the things that We've like people that talk about it in a number of blogs and even in real life before. The the, the trickle down to y'all ain't really gonna be that good because it's like yo, this is your leader, this, this is your king, this is your king, this is how he's moving, and you know people will, will get at them and it looks kind of crazy. And I'm not even gonna hold you when it comes to URL. Ryder don't really get no looks like that anyway. I mean, let's be what do you? I, I guess what 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 he get? What what the what the fuck he got? I don't even know what he got. What? He don't really be getting no looks like that. I don't know if they don't really fuck with him like that or whatever the case may be. He's had some battles, but there's people coming that's after him. Like Ace Amin got B Magic coming up on the app card. Ryder's not getting a B Magic, you know what I'm saying? Like that's just they not gonna give him that kind of a name. And even if that is a name, is that a name? Ace Amin was on the volume, Swap was on the volume, Ryder's not on the volume, you know what I'm saying? Like they don't really they treat him like wet dog food. Which means I would say a lot of these artists should handle their own careers. You see Chef Trez, he's like, fuck that. I'm going to battle wherever I want. I've been saying these guys should handle their own careers, especially when people are playing with your career and ain't really fucking with you like that. You know what I'm saying? It's clear to see who, who gets fucked with versus who doesn't. You know what I'm saying? Like, you could tell by the moves that are being made. And whether it be the talent or whether it be whatever, I don't really rock with you like that. I mean, I, I think that you got some cool stuff. You know what I'm saying? I would love to see, you know what I'm saying, you versus a couple names. I see Mr. Wavy versus Rich Dollars. Rich dollars on a card? Are you serious? Rich, rich? Showtime, where are you? Get your man, who? Y'all brought rich dollars back. If you want to, if you're being scouted, recruited, or told that, you know, you're going to be in the future plans or whatever, and you see a card come out with rich dollars on it and you're not on it, they ain't really fucking with you. I'm just telling you right now. Hold on, I got something for you. You don't even worry about it. Well, 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 well. It's Sunday. You know what I'm saying? You know, I got it low. I keep it, keep it low, keep it low, keep it low. This is for you. If you don't, if you can't get booked, if you can't get booked on a card with rich dollars on it in 2020, this is, you should come and join me. You know what I'm saying? You let me know. I got a seat here for you where you can start blogging because uh, if your career is not jogging, you might want to start blogging. This shit might not be for you. I'm be honest with you. Like, Rich Doll, when is the last time Rich Dollars has done anything worth talking about? Who? Man, I see Old Red vs. Danger Zone on that card. You had to battle Danger because the way you got smoked. Like, the way you got smoked by JC, that sent you from where you was heading. To down here having the battle danger zone. That's the thing. You go up there, you get your ass beat. You gotta come back him downstairs. You gotta come downstairs. You gotta battle from the floor up. It's not a big look for you, old red. You, if you don't lose, if you if, if you lose to danger zone, you gonna have to go be. They gonna make you go be a goonie. You know what I'm saying? Like, John John's the one that really fucked that whole group up. If you think about it, what John John did to Jack was like starting to be some of the beginning of the end. Like he was the one that really messed that thing up. Throwing that chain in the crowd, go get it. The whole Black Wolf thing, that should look crazy. It looks super crazy. And now Ryder and Gluizzi have left. Now, I will say, Gluizzi does have talent. I liked him versus Tay Rock. Um, Jerry West, not so much. But uh, him versus Tay Rock, I did like it. I like that aggression. Like the aggression that he had in the Tay Rock battle, like not backing down. You know, standing up to rock, you know, having the, the bunch of the angles and shit that he had. I did like it. I'm not going to hold you. And I think Louisi is a talent, but some people need to be on their own. And then you can find your way through this shit. I think the problem with them was they all were still super brand new and they just jumped in a click together. And when they jumped in a click, it was kind of like Twerk was like always the the. 
head and shoulders above everybody else. So when they teamed up, it was like, you'll see Twerk get seven battles before you see any one of them get one battle. He'll get like, Song Madness, Gnome, this card, that card. He was getting every fucking card. Every fucking card. And these niggas wasn't getting booked at all. You know what I'm saying? And then you seen Jack Boy Main start to trickle up a little bit. Then he had to battle with um, Big T. And then, you know, he, he got busy with the freaky, freaky, the icky, 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 and all that shit. And then he got booked first John John. And then John John, bow, clipped his wings. And now it is what it is. But y'all let me know. Um, Ryder and Gluezy have left the Goonies. I think Twerk and uh, Drugs already have moved out of the house already. You know what I'm saying? I know they were saying that it's still Goonies and all this other shit, but what we see out here, you kind of left them niggas. You know what I'm saying? And, and I don't even know if they knew. They may have known, you know what I'm saying? But the way Gluezy and Ryder made their tweets today, they just pretty much said we out. And Ace, I mean, bounce too. You got beat Magic next. That should be a pretty good battle. But with that B-Magic that I just seen versus uh, Deuce, he got a little crazy. He got a little fucking crazy. So I'm, um, I'm going to let y'all have that. But other than that, you already know what it's doing, what it does. I'll be back tonight with my man Showtime SP, keeping this thing going. Rah.